uh, hello guys today we are going to discuss about chat application using server and client within two pc okay so first we are create the server chat these are the code from the server chat uh, first i will show you design okay uh, this is a take the box of host number and this is a take box of port number start in start first i will call a class ip address and in ip address class i pass the host txt host text okay and uh, server dot start in server dot start method there are two parameter which is ip first uh, ip is convert the host into ip address and uh, a port number also there is another parameter of start method now stop is also value for uh, if condition as uh, if server dot is started then server dot stop and sta status what is status okay first i will show you the name of the tag box is okay txt message that can send and uh, the txt status okay in server side create a simple tcp server class which is installed from project first i will show you this is a simple txt server class and i using library team simple tcp uh, right click uh, manage nuggets packages okay i already installed uh, simple tcp uh, in your case write a simple tcp okay yeah in my case i have already installed a tcp client server okay if you want to install make install okay using simple tcp first i create a simple tcp server reference and in page form one page load event i create the object of simple tcp server uh, i define the delimiter and a string encode uh, string encode might be encoding dot utf8 okay uh, string data received in is data received method string server data received uh, txt status status there is a status ok dot invoke uh, method invoke dot uh, delegate uh, e dot message string what uh, simple tcb ok and e dot reply line from uh, string format ok we use the utf8 also uh, use it E dot message string okay after the all the code of server side okay this is the design of server side uh, I also view the code of send also send there is one line code to send a server to client message server dot broadcast what is which is you broadcast you want uh, the txt message only okay now further with client side client side is also same procedure first okay in client side simple tcp client okay uh, right click on and manage the package package okay 
in, if you are installing a simple DCB client, uh, it is uh, available in recent package. Okay, and first uh, preference of the uh, simple DCB client and in page load, uh, page load event, uh, same procedure of uh, server side and uh, client data received uh, status also same design of server side okay uh, there is also message and uh, txt status port and host uh, first connect okay in connect uh, i disable the this, uh, connect button if first time once in uh, connect there is enabled is equal to false okay and uh, client don't connect which client uh, which client do you want to connect in which server so i will define the txt host and the convert to in the port number is converted into integer okay uh, also same procedure of the server side and data received okay same as oh yeah pretty good txt button send button send yeah client dot write line and get reply easily is one line code between client data sent to server okay txt message uh, what is this time spans from this second first i will show you uh, our program output okay i will i run the server i run the server program and uh, now client side uh, client side also run now we are check server and this is client okay i start the server connected no it is now not connected okay from first message i send from client side hey server hey server Send. Oh wait, yeah, it's got it. 